Hi, today I'm going to show you Nigaf Step 10.1, Nigaf Step 2, 10.1, um, um, running the Jelly Bean OTA leak for Samsung. That means it's not official, but it's Jelly Bean and it's developed by Samsung. It was released a while ago by Sam Mobile. Okay, the firmware was released. Anyway, let's start. Now, this is not official. If you want this, um, check the link in the description. It's a link to XDA, and there you will have uh, how to get it root and CWN, which is custom recovery. Anyway, first thing I'm going to show you is the quadrant. Okay, you can see here the device is rating. A uh, wonderful score of yes, your score okay, 2649. Wonderful score if you say, if you ask me, I mean, this is Samsung, and I'm really surprised by the fact that Samsung did such a wonderful job with this update. I think it's much, much smoother than ICS, uh, Samsung ICS. And if you ask me, in my opinion, I think it's better than uh, Sanji mode because I I, I like the uh, the fact that it's tablet friendly. I mean, with Sanji mode is not is not that tablet friendly. Friendly, um, for example, for example, if you install an APK from the file manager, uh, it will become like this, something like a. Um, I'll just show you. Let's go to okay, out of Photoshop. Now, you will have this a small screen. It does not fit all the screen. It does not scale the app like the uh, uh, Sunshine mode. Anyway, okay. So now I'm gonna just scroll to show you how smooth it is. Even this is the. TW launcher. This is a Samsung stock launcher. I mean, I did not modify anything. It's just so fast, I think. Yeah. Uh, you could see that how fast and smooth it is comparing it to the Samsung ICS. Uh, if you put a wallpaper, it will lag a little, but still, it is a wonderful. Uh, experience anyway you have the widgets here like you just like the anyway so now next thing I'm gonna show you is um, let's go to settings I'm gonna confirm that it's jelly bean about oh, blah 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 press this and jelly bean wonderful now I'm gonna show you the browser and the speed. Uh, someone asked me on um, the CM9 review of the browser uh, if I could just show the browser review, it would be good. That's why I'm showing the browser here. Anyway, I've noticed some bugs. It's still not stable yet. Very stable. I, I mean, it's it's good for everyday use, but there's an annoying bug in the browser. I mean, if I just do this, okay. Let's say select all, and the tablet just immediately stops responding. Can't do anything. Work, okay. Done, done, done. Uh, it force closes. This is one bug I found. Uh, extremely annoying. Now, next thing um, you could notice the sound. It's like the S3 sound. You have new things like if you go set it to settings. I'll go to uh, the one of the new things is blocking mode. I think it blocks sound, block, disable incoming uh, calls and whatever. A uh, new thing also in the lock screen. You say lock screen options. You have shortcuts now. You can't customize the shortcuts. Just choose which uh, you press. And you, okay, you press on the app itself and choose which shortcut you want. In my case, I'll choose a browser here. 
Where's the browser? <laughs> anyway. So let's show you. You have these shortcuts. It's pretty fast. Uh, let's just see um, the alarm clock. Yes, directly are in the alarm clock app. And you have this annoying Samsung S3 voice. I have no idea why they put the sound here. And then because dun, 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 dun. it's like water droplets, which is like the nature UX on the Samsung S3. Anyway, now. As far as you've seen, this is a stock Samsung, uh, stock Samsung interference. Uh, next thing I'm going to show you is that they have an all new all share play app, different design, and uh, then now we're going to show you gaming. Oh no! First, let's show you the. I just remembered something. Video player. You have the new pop up play. Okay, just lower, higher resolution. Good. Now, you press this and voila. You have the, even with subtitles. Okay, just let her talk. So you have this, of course, this uh, with subtitles. You could notice that. Anyway, next, I will show you. Um, go to after now the music player. I think it's updated. I have seen now. Uh, It's a good, good sound quality. Uh, the same as ICS. I think it's a bit, a little louder. There was a bug earlier in this beat version that made the sound so low. So um, yeah, uh, it's now fixed. You can see that in the link that I it's in the description. Anyway, and that's it, folks. Um, you want to see? Let's just start a game, maybe. Yes, game. Let's go to the games folder and the latest game. And if Need for Speed Most Wanted. Okay. Sorry about the focus issues for a minute. Okay, and it's fixed. Now, you have, uh, let's press on this one. Let's choose the hot side. Okay. Because this car, the one for me, was the carbon. Anyway, empty GTR. Of course, uh, you can see how smooth the players. I'm just trying out uh, that. Okay. Oh, yeah, but you can see it does not lag. Okay. 
I'm not playing right now, I'm just showing you the map. Anyway. And close the app. So you see, it doesn't lag, and ha you have many apps here open while the game is running smooth, 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 jelly bean smooth. And that's it, folks. Uh, that's the Jelly Bean OTA leak review. If you want anything further, just comment, and I will make a video of whatever you want. Anyway, of the Galaxy Tab on the Galaxy Tab, of course. Tab 2. Anyways, thanks for watching, and please subscribe if you like the video, if you dislike the video, dislike it. If you like it, like it. And um, if you want to share it, share it. Subscribe, share, Facebook, Twitter, Google+. Anyway, and thank you for watching the video. Bye-bye.